Video game movies have been around for some time now and there doesn't appear to be an end in sight. Join us now as we look at video game movies either in development or scheduled to be released. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell for daily video game content. Release dates can get pushed back, so unless the film is set for a release soon, such as our first entry, expect the unexpected. You'll hear the term development hell mentioned a lot, where some projects become stuck at the preparation stage for years, and as we'll see, a good number of films have been stuck in developmental hell. But let's look at number 1, Sonic the Hedgehog, 14th February 2020. A Sonic film has been in development since Sony Pictures landed the rights in 2013. After bouncing back, or should we say running from Sony to Paramount Pictures, shooting on the film finally started. Originally scheduled for an 8th November 2019 release, the film was pushed back due to negative reactions to Sonic's humanoid appearance. With Sonic redesigned, the film looks to be on track for its new release date. This looks like it could be fun with Jim Carrey playing Dr. Robotnik and Jason Schwartz voicing Sonic. Number 2. Monster Hunter, 4th September 2020 Capcom's Monster Hunter game has proven popular and director Paul W.S. Anderson is looking to turn the game into a successful film franchise, much as he did with Capcom's Resident Evil games. Anderson says the movie will feature new characters as well as familiar characters such as the Handler and the Admiral. Number 3. Without Remorse, 18th September 2020 This one has been in development hell pretty much since Tom Clancy's book Without Remorse was released back in 1993. Michael B. Jordan stars in this film, portraying Navy SEAL John Clark, a man seeking vengeance for his wife's murder while he tries to unravel a baffling conspiracy. Jordan is signed to play Clark in Paramount's Rainbow Six Siege films, which is based on Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six novels and of course the video game series. Without Remorse is still being filmed and hopefully will be a success like Jordan's Black Panther rather than his Fantastic Four. Oof, we're still trying to unsee that one. Number 4. Uncharted Treasure hunter Nathan Drake will make his first silver screen appearance in 2021 following his video game debut back in 2007's Uncharted Drake's Fortune for PlayStation 3. According to the Internet Movie Database, the film is in pre-production with Spider-Man actor Tom Holland reportedly playing Drake and Mark Wahlberg playing Drake's mentor Sully. Number 5. Mortal Kombat 15th January 2021 One of the earliest video game films, Mortal Kombat is being rebooted and finished filming in December 2019. Now in post-production, the film is being prepared for its release next year. The film will reportedly carry a hard R rating and feature fatalities just like those captured in the video game. Number 6. Tomb Raider 2, 19th March 2021 It's hard to believe the original Tomb Raider series is nearly two decades old, or that MGM and Warner Brothers greenlit a sequel after the mediocre reviews for the 2018 film. Then again, quality comes second as long as a film brings in those dollars. Just look at the Disney Star Wars franchise. Whatever the case, Alicia Vikander, who played Lara Croft in the 2018 edition, is on board for the sequel. Number 7. Minecraft the Movie, 4th March 2022 If there can be an Angry Birds movie, two by the latest count, why not a Minecraft film? According to IGN.com, Peter Soleil, Nick and Nora's Infinite Playlist will direct the Minecraft movie, which will tell the story of a teenage girl trying to save the overworld from an ender dragon. And number 8. Super Mario Bros. The Movie 2020 Illumination Entertainment is producing this animated film based on the ever-popular Super Mario games. In case you've been trapped in a sewer for the last 30 plus years, here's the film's plot. A plumber named Mario travels through an underground labyrinth with his brother Luigi trying to save a captured princess. No word on casting, but it sure would be sweet if they could digitize the late great Captain Lou Albano, who played Mario in the Super Mario Bros. Super Show television series, and we can only hope this film will be better than the 1993 film, which should have been left in a sewer. But there you have it guys, upcoming films based on video games. Are you excited about any of these films? Be sure to leave your comments down below, subscribe if you haven't already, follow us on Instagram and Twitter, and I'll see you next time with some more video game content.